The company was established in 1919 by my grandfather, John Bojack, who came to New Bedford after World War I, after fighting for the Free Polish Army out of Canada. And he got a doctor to Paris to lend him, I think it was $10,000, and he built his own laundry and opened up on January 1st, 1919. So that grew, and then my father, after World War II in Korea, he was in, they were doing dry cleaning, home laundry was going down the tubes, dry cleaning, coin op, and then they got into rental by chance. And then about 1980, 81, finally got rid of all of the rental I'm sorry, the coin op, dry cleaning, and home laundry finally went away and really started pushing the uniform rental in the early 80s. It's, it's still owned by the Bojack family. Uh, myself, with my sister, run it day to day. We continue to be family-owned, family-managed, which is very important. We're, you know, we're, we're in the business and on the business at the same time. Um. We're currently operating out of three locations, our main plant being in New Bedford, Massachusetts, and depots in Londonderry, New Hampshire, and Manchester, Connecticut. So we initially moved into this building um, with the IPC sort of system. Um, she was really good to us for about 20 years, um, but like anything, gets tired and antiquated, even though it was much more advanced than many of our competitors. Um, at that point, obviously Mark, being the hardware technology guy, um, started doing his homework, and that's when we were introduced to Jensen, and the rest speaks for itself. That was the beginning of a great working relationship through today, literally. I think everybody in the company that was has dealt with Jensen, uh, originally our decision to start with them, I think they're a very innovative company. And once you do get their equipment, they're very responsive to any of your needs for service. In, in marketing our technology, which is obviously a competitive advantage, advantage it's most important to communicate it to the clients because you can say you have something, but my first question as a client would be, well, what does that mean to me? And what it means to them, obviously, quality, processing, um, efficient, effective, accurate processing, um, accountability, et cetera, et cetera. Um,